We have had the most consistently average youth intake I think I've ever seen. And for, for once, the good youth intake four star is probably correct. We've normally you get like a maybe a couple of gems that you're and, and everything else is just sort of drakes, you know, rubbish. We've got a load of players that probably aren't going to ever be good enough, but are also quite decent and will probably have a footballing career. We've got two goalkeepers, got a bunch of defenders, got a striker, right back, left back, right wing. And none of them are like, normally I'm very, what's the word? I like to kill a lot of children's dreams. And I would just basically take on the ones that I know might actually be good enough to play for me. But I thought, you know what? Let's give this guy... We're going to give them all... Fucking hell. I might take it back. Calm down, mate. No, all the others are on 100 quid a week. If you can't deal with that, fine. Nobody's really standing out. But they might be all right. Might make a little bit of money, maybe. Uh, whatever. But, you know, would have liked some superstar, but it's not to be. Greetings and salutations, my friends. Welcome back. This is probably the biggest episode of the season so far. We are playing top of the league, and then we are playing the second leg against Trenzin, who we beat 3-0 in the first leg after beating them 1-0 twice in a row. <laughs> That's got to be some record, isn't it? Got to play them five times in two months, three times in a row. They must be absolutely... They haven't scored a goal yet. Uh, the big news, Novak scored. Considering how good Novak was at the start of the season and the fact we haven't changed tactic, he's played in the exact same role, exact same tactic. That was his first goal in 15 league games. Mm -hmm. Mental. Uh, I did rest him for one game against uh, Trenton in the cup uh, thing because I promised that I'd play the other guy. He didn't do much. Bought Novak in. Maybe that's just, maybe he got complacent. Maybe that's just spiced him up a bit. So this is obviously a massive game. We can... Oh, they drew a game. Okay, we go above them if we win. But I think this is the away game, right? We Obviously, we just take a draw here. Um, so, Shelbourne's... But Maggie is back, who has started admirably at centre-back. What a signing this guy's turning out to be. Averaging 7.62 centre-back without a goal. Pretty decent. Boyo is out for a bit of time now. Six weeks. I just don't... I'm just thinking that this role is not working in our system. They don't get involved... They don't get involved enough in the actual goal scoring. They're deep line forwards. That's kind of a bit more understandable. But they also... None of them, whoever plays there, actually gets involved in creating goals. So it's like... Are you just running about a bit? I'll give it a couple more games... And then we might just change the role and do something different. Um, right, the rest is good. After saying that ball-winning midfielders just get terrible ratings, um, Sipka's getting, he's averaging 7.27. Most of those games have been our ball-winning midfielder. So, right, Mooney's going to come in. Your dad's dropped off form a bit. He probably doesn't care as much. Uh, Boyo's out injured. Six weeks. He's having a great time. I'm looking at the wrong one. I don't mean Boyo. Enow, he was out injured for like three, four weeks playing for the reserves. So if I swear to God, if he kicks up a fuss because he's not getting first team football, I'm like, I literally can't give to you first team football until next season. So we've got money in the bank. We've got transfer money to spend. We've got wages to spend. But because I know that we, whatever happens from here on out, we are going to get a big bump in reputation. The players we can attract are going to be so much better. So rather than just going now, trying to get some contracts that are ending, trying to bring them in, I'm just going to wait to the end of the season, get a nice little bump. They'll come flooding to me. All right, come on, boys. If you can't win, at least cause some injuries. Right. Easy. Okay, it's a shot target. We'll take it. <clears throat> I'm kind of ready for the Premier League to come back now. I've enjoyed my break. As Liverpool fans, our sort of football break started about halfway through the season. So actually, you know, it's been probably five, six months since I've cared about the Premier League. <laughs> oh no, that's a horrendous pass. Okay. What's the other door? There's so many players. Oh, it's not. He's off. He's off. Okay, good. 
yeah, I'm kind of ready for football to start now. I will be doing a predictions video, as always, because it's one of the most fun things. So get your thinking caps on. I don't think... Oh, I don't think I'm going to predict Liverpool to win the league this year. But I might well do. I'm trying to sort of temper my expectations, but then when we, we're making these signings, I'm like, oh, he's quite good, isn't he? I've heard of him, so he must be quite good. All right, pretty even first half. We have more shots. They've created better chances. Fitness is good for the boys. What, what about... What about... What? Hmm? Is this terrible? Is this terrible? Do they sit that far apart? That looks weird. Is this terrible? They're just going to get in each other's way? What about that? Not that. 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 Because we've got a defensive winger. He's not bombing on as much, and he can play. I'm going to try it. Get Novak right in the middle. He's our great hope. Let's try it. Um, Durich can come on mainly for set pieces. It's like if James Ward-Prowse signed for Real Madrid. He's, James Ward-Prowse is a good footballer, but he's not Real Madrid level. However, his set pieces are, and that's Durich for us. He's like shit Ward-Prowse. Okay. I think obviously good header away, big header away. Daninger. Oh, that's a nice ball. Lovely first touch. Pi deals with it. pi has been brilliant so far. Okay. They seem to be getting the upper hand a little bit in this game. We need to get a bit of control, boys. Get out to him. Winners. Win the second ball. Norbert. Oh, Jesus, that's a ball. That's back inside. Oh, the pie makes another great save. I don't want to go long. Mind distributing a bit longer though. Got to get out from the, this. Oh, did he make a save? I don't know, but <laughs> I calm yourselves. Focus. I can't say anything. Okay, take a draw, lads. Take a draw. This is falling apart quite quickly. Um, how's Norbert's fitness? Is okay. Um. Defenders are all playing well. Kromosta can come on for you. Svex had a couple of really good games recently. He scored a goal. Okay, let's freshen up. Let's freshen up the wings. That's not what I wanted to do. Okay, almost a, another classic mistake there. Right, boys. Fire him up a bit. Okay. Hang on, lads. We'll take this, and then we just beat them at home. Scrappy 1-0 win. Job done. Okay, we'll take that. That's a good result. Yeah, no, I'm not going to be critical of that. They are still a better side than us, so we'll take that. Right, quite an important... We're 3-0 up, but the game itself was quite even. Murich, our centre-back, scored his first ever goal for the club and then got himself a brace because he discovered he liked scoring goals. But it was actually a pretty even game. So let's not get too carried away. We go full strength. Let's do this. Right, let's. Nice chill. If I played one up top. If I played one up top. Maybe had added a DM. Push the two centre mid. We'll, what, let's just finish this season. Sipka's out for. How long is he out for? Five days. Which is annoying. Piscatelli can come in. Bang in another solid 6.5 performance. You're ineligible. Okay. Uh, God, you're just playing so bad. If he doesn't get... If he doesn't get a penalty or free kick or corners assists, his rating is terrible. Right, Maggie. 
I'm gonna keep the left foot so you're a little bit tired. We'll go Maggie there. Kromoska, Kromosta for Benkovsky. I like my centre back options. Really happy with those at the moment. It does mean big purchase next season is going to be the main man striker. All the best out there. Have fun. Right, let's do it. We're three 0 up. Don't get complacent. Almost a horrendous pass there. Norbert wins the header. Can we win the second ball? No. Don't concede early. Don't plant the seed of doubt. Nice. Lovely. Go on, Novak. Oh, it was so deadly. Maybe he's like twin brothers snuck in and he's shit at football. I'll take up now. Big crowd here for this one. They really care about the cup, don't they? Jesus. There's two. There's two people. Okay, not the best corner. Palacio. We'll put no, we're not. Okay, endless highlights. I just get a goal and it's done. Novak, lovely touch. Plays it in. Scooped up. Lejeune nods it back. Norbert. Let's go, Norbert. <clears throat> Beautiful stuff. We take that. It's done. Uh, what did... It's the two big guns playing out in the other game. Where? What was the first leg? Okay. They won 2-1 against Thunder. Okay. All right. Come on, Dunstreda. Probably the easier opponent. Uh-oh. Rut roll. Hedgy. Good ball over. We've got men to him, though. Yes, Norbert's done well. Clears the danger. Can we press this guy? I mean, it's with a good header. Piscatelli. Jesus. Wobble. Lovely touch from Lejeune. Oh, lovely ball. For Toot. For two Goalkeeper's weird positioning, and we will take it. It's 2-0. It's done. Goalkeeper came out at a really weird angle, then got very confused by life in general. Lovely first touch from the Ginger Maestro. That touch, keeper's just not quick at all. Can't move his legs. <laughs> and this is glorious. Will they score a goal against us? This is the fourth game in like six matches. Can they do it? We've got one more, <laughs> two more after this. We've got one more after this. Oh, they've done it! Grab the ball, son. Grab the ball. Go on. It's a good finish. Oh, Dunstreader are winning. It's two all on aggregate. Let's go. At the Dunnies. Probably not what they're called. Yeah, we're good. Um, let's let's try something. Let's try something. Okay. Um. Bosch, Bosch, Shadow Striker, and then Ball and Midfielder Support, which would actually suit Sipka when he comes back a little bit more. Attack? Should we go to lob him on attack? Why not? Why not? Mazella actually might. <clears throat> Don't think we have anybody capable of doing that. Okay. Put you in. Um, and then we're going to go with... Uh, he can't defend. Your dad can't defend. Okay. You. What do we want you to be? Yeah, no, I think that's fine. Because these are going to go forward a little bit. So we'll have a bit of space in front of him. Milich is dead. Murat's going to come in and they can swap. And let's let's see. Let's have a look. About 10 shots. 62% possession. Should be defensively a little bit more solid, but we are pretty good anyway. Right. Campo Basso. All right. If they, I won't. I won't worry if they if they score one more. 
like in this highlight. Hello? The ball's... What? The ball's not going to you, dickhead. What is that? Oh my god, he's just full sprinting, full beans at the pitch, and the ball's fucking 30 yards behind him. <laughs> okay. What if you play... What about a deep-lying defender? It's getting a bit scrappy, lads. It's getting a bit scrappy. What about a deep-lying defender? Not that we like, have one that can actually defend and also pass. That's... Okay. They're having a go. Maybe it's this terrible tactic change, but they're definitely having a go. And it away again. He's run past the ball. Are they having trouble seeing the ball? One sec. Oh, good header back, Svek. He's picked up the second half. The chances he's had, he's been better. Dunstred at 2 0 up. They will be going through as it stands. Ooh, um, don't have any right wingers. Ah, Jurich. You play shit wherever I play you unless you've got a corner, so might as well. Can they get a second goal? Campo Basso. It's a good name. Oh, it's a great goal. I feel like the goalkeeper got there, but just didn't use his hands. Okay, it's 2-2. Two, two. I'm blaming it on complacency rather than a terrible tactic change. Okay? We can all agree? Good? Okay. Novak, decent. Svek, play inside. There we go, your dad. Marauding down this left-hand side. Oh, lovely. Svek. Cuts it back. Oh, it's deflected. <laughs> Poor Novak. He can't get any luck either, can he? All right. This is fine. This is all good. That's how we did it. We smashed him in the first leg. Get it done in the second leg. And we are through to the cup final against... Is it Dunstreader? Did they... Yes. Okay. They're beatable. I'd rather play them. This is good. But is the cup final going to be right at the end of the season? Or are they doing a weird thing? Is it one leg? It's not the end of the season, but it is one leg. Four days after we just play them. Okay, that's fine. Cup final, boys. Cup final. Oh, they've won it the last four years in a row. I wish I hadn't looked at that. That's a little... Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Uh, somebody's got to stop them at some point, right? Not necessarily, they could just win it forever. But they're not going to because we're going to win. Right, there we go. A successful episode. A solid draw. We were the worst team, but we managed to get a draw against Bratislava. And we get into the final of the cup. Job done. Let's go marching on. If we're in the cup final, that boosts the reputation. We might even get an extra nipple. What's our... We are two and a half star. What if we compare ourselves to like... They're probably only like three star or something, aren't they? Yeah. And Dunstreda... Yeah, but if we can get up there with them, and then with my transfer genius, we will smash them next season, win everything, leave on a high, get a massive job in Sweden. That's the plan. Right, there we go, my friends. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.